Here's a message from C.J. Lovick, author of the widely popular Living Word in 3D series. Watch as he unfolds a mystery hidden just under the surface. The four letters Aleph, Hay, Bet, Hay compose the amazing Hebrew word Ahava. Translated into English, Ahava means love. The first time the word love is used in the scripture is in Genesis 22, 2. Listen to what it says. And he said, that's God, Take now thy son, thine only son Isaac, whom thou lovest, and get thee into the land of Moriah, and offer him there for a burnt offering upon one of the mountains, which I will tell thee of. Abraham, of course, was prevented by God in the final act of this messianic drama from sacrificing his only son Isaac. This drama is a messianic prophetic picture of our loving Heavenly Father who would offer up his own son as a sacrifice for our sins. What do the pictures under the four letters Aleph, He, Bet, He reveal? Aleph, the first letter in the Hebrew word love or Ahava, is pictured as an ox and means a strong leader. He's the first, and in the ideal meaning, it's God the Father. He, the second letter in the Hebrew word love, is pictured as a man lifting up his eyes and hands to heaven, and it means to reveal or to behold. Bet, the third letter in the Hebrew word love, is pictured as the one who comes out of the house. He is the son. The ideal picture meaning of Bet is the son of God. He, as we've already learned, is the picture that means to behold. God the Father reveals himself to us through his only begotten Son. That is the picture meaning of Ahava, or love. John 1.18 tells us that no man hath seen God at any time. The only begotten Son, which is in the bosom of the Father, he hath declared him. Notice that when you take the two Hebrew letters, He, out of the word for love, you end up with the Aleph and the Bet. Aleph and Bet is a picture of the Father. It is the picture of the Father and the Son. Now add He, the Holy Spirit, and you have the complete picture of love, a word that declares the Father, Aleph, the Son, Bet, and the Holy Spirit, He. And how is it that God shows his love for mankind? The answer is found in John 3.14. Listen to what it says. And as Moses lifted up the serpent in the wilderness, even so the Son of Man must be lifted up, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have eternal life. This is the way that God has Ahava, the world. There are literally hundreds of precious mysteries found in the ancient Hebrew. To learn more, get the book, The Living Word in 3D, Volume 1, from rockislandbooks.com. To learn more about this word and other Hebrew words, subscribe to livingwordin3d.com, and we'll send you a new word every week.